Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Azodi. Today we are going to be doing Taeon Happy. And if you are new to the channel, welcome. It's great to have you here. I've been a K-pop producer for a few years and a songwriter producer for about 15 years. Awesome. Let's do this. Let's go. Oh yes, I know this vibe straight away. I love this vibe. Oh. That's different. Okay. Awesome. All right, straight off the bat, it's got that classic pop sound that you would hear reminiscent of maybe the 50s. Bouncy piano, high keys. And I've written a few songs myself like this, but yeah, I absolutely love this sound. Straight away, it gives me that amazing sense of nostalgia and yeah, makes me happy. <laughs> great, great title, right? <laughs> Uh, you can hear a subtle Fender Rhodes keyboard playing the chords subtly underneath and it sounds like they've applied a little bit of panning on it and phasing a popular effect to use on a Fender Rhodes. Panning is where you have the center here and you have left and right speaker and you utilize the stereo space between the left and right speaker. Sounds like we're moving into the pre-chorus build. Makes me feel so good. Oh yes. Oh, that's nice. Nice bit of tension there. The chorus, and it's a subtle lift. It's not like a massive chorus, but personally, if I was producing a track like this, you wouldn't want the chorus to be massive because it may take away from that sort of beauty and it's kind of like innocence to it. Even though it's subtle, there's a new hat and it's driving the rhythm of the chorus and pushing it a little bit forward. And they've introduced more vocal harmonies to pad out the sides of the chorus. Awesome. Nice. Awesome. This is the main hook of the song, and they're drilling it into this second part of the chorus. Is that a Zoom call? <laughs> it's very easy to follow a certain rhythm with these types of pop songs, where it's da da. Da, 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 and you accent each of the chord changes with a kick. But what the producer has done here is they've added an extra kick to give it a little bit more rhythm, a little bit more groove, and simply just to do it differently from everyone else. It's crazy. Oh. And it sounds like they've added this nice little flute sort of hitting these high notes and it's just a subtle simple thing but it's just to show you that okay something's changed here it's like a storybook start at the beginning and you kind of want to take people on a journey to the end of the book and you subtly introduce new stuff as you go along as the story progresses and it's the same with songwriting <laughs> make you just want to sway. Nice, <laughs> I love that chord change. Grace that makes you sit forward, doesn't it? Sounds like we're in the B chorus now. Nice. 
So we've moved into the bridge mid late and it's a chance to step away from the rest of the song and do something a bit different. Because I've written this type of pop music before, I know a very popular movement to do is to move to the relative minor. Every major scale or every happy scale has a brother or sister scale which is in a minor key where it becomes more serious or more sad it's very popular to hear it in a bridge as well this style has been around for ages if you check out the song earth angel that's a very good example of this type of pop song you may have noticed the entire time through this song i've just been smiling because it just i love this style so much it's just that nice bittersweet nostalgia <laughs> Nice. It looks very vintage, isn't it, visually? Extra vocal ad-libs in the chorus to show you development. I love that nostalgic, bittersweet feeling that Happy has given me. Uh, what about you guys? What feeling does it give you? It was cool that they didn't go too overboard with it and they kind of knew to pull back and just keep that innocence about the song, that kind of pure feeling about the song, which was really nice. I just want to say thank you so much to my patrons for supporting this channel. And if you want to make your own K-pop requests, support this channel on Patreon. Thanks so much and I will see you next week.